today marks a great day in our program and, and really part of just uh, the natural progression of any America's Cup team. And I think for our team in particular, it's a culmination of you know, roughly 80,000 man hours of work into boat two and the design and build of that boat. A great moment for the production team and for the design team. The design team, you know, has given us a piece of equipment that, you know, not only fits the rule but can get us around the racetrack very quickly and my job is just to try and make it work within its optimum. The development that's taking place since boat one was launched has been huge, not just in terms of design but also in learning how to sail the boats and learning how the attitude of the boat in the water is, is optimized for, for maximum performance. First one's been great. Now we need to make sure that this boat gets to the America's Cup. I think having done so much time on uh, Defiant, uh, it's all going to put us in good stead to, to get out there and get sailing the boat pretty quickly and in a good good manner. So you know, we're looking forward to that. The bow shape and the well, the whole boat is just maximising driving force, you know, and minimising the healing moments that you're producing, you know. I christen the. Patriot. May God bless this yacht and all who sail her. It feels like there's just been hurdle after hurdle of things on the outside, completely out of our control, and I'm always impressed by the level of just commitment that everybody shows to just keep working and keep doing our jobs and, and uh, the rest will take care of itself. The style of racing with the race course being confined, I think it will keep the boats close together. If the class is very much a development class, if someone's going to be fast, you hope that's going to be uh, for yourself. The difference between the mule and burst boat here is enormous, and we had to learn how to do it along the way. So if we can continue to learn on that steep part of the learning curve, you know, with this platform, we're going to be in, in competitive shape from race time. It's great to be in Auckland where we have to race and we have to develop and and really get ourselves on form for the match. You know, we've kind of followed our own path here. We were the first to do the mule, we were first foiling in an AC-75. Now, if it's not fast, it probably doesn't really mean anything other than you're good at sticking to the calendar and the deadlines that you set, so we're gonna make sure it's fast. From now on, it's just a matter of taking the boat to its uh, full potential, which is not an easy thing to do. We're confident that we've done, done a good job. We've, done, uh, we've dedicated a lot of uh, effort. This is the boat that should win the American Cup.